Hey everybody, welcome back. So glad you're here with me today. Today I have for you the November Zany Laney scents. And we gotta go over some things first. Starting off with the party that we usually have every month is a week earlier this month from November 11th to 16th because of Thanksgiving. We don't want to interrupt your family time. And, uh, doo -doo -doo. uh, so we will be running it on Facebook and Instagram. So you have double the chances of winning a $5 credit or a prize. And it's usually a $5 credit. And, uh, there's some new things coming, uh, Everything will start pre-sale. Pre-sale has started, and pre-sale will end November. I wrote this down. I thought I wrote it down. Uh, it ends at the end of November, and there's new products. There is a body conditioner, which will be two ounces for six dollars. It's kind of like this lotiony cleanser. You put it on your loofah and uh, rub a dub dub. <laughs> uh, there's also body scrub, they reformulated, and you can't get it in any of the cinnamon scents because cinnamon allergies for skin are very common. I know some people say they don't have them, but better safe than sorry. Um, the body scrub, I'm not sure about the size, but that will be $7. Um, it's a drier formula instead of more wet, and it has um, apricot kernel oil. I think that's an apricot, apricot, blah, blah, blah. Uh, but a nice oil for your body, and that will be $7. And you can now, made to order, get buttons like round buttons with Marshall's artwork on it those are made to order and uh they look pretty fab I think I'm not a button collector but button um I might get some definitely probably in the Ohana sunrise one because that's my favorite because it's Lilo and Stitch <laughs> uh you could still get digital downloads of his artwork as well for your desktop or your phone. You can buy those right off the site. And there you go. Uh, they're no longer selling four ounce sprays um, or postcards, but they could be on clearance during the party. So without further ado, I give you the new uh, Zinny Lenny scent theme is called, uh, Park, it's Parks and Rec, and it's called I Love You and I Like You. I don't have experience watching the show, um, but I like Amy Poehler. She's really funny, and Aubrey Plaza, I think she's in there, and those two actresses, I I've always really liked, so I should like it. I don't know. But from what I get, from the gist of it, I get it's all about, like, community and being friends. And that's what you want this time of year. That's what you feel this time of year, or I hope you do. Like, surrounding yourself with good people and uh, just feeling the love and being thankful for everything that you have. So there are, um, I did get a list of what the scents, uh, episodes, references. So I will leave that down below as well. Uh, it's, it's too much for my brain. And also if you want to become a rep like me, I will leave a form down for you below and you could try. Now let's get started. Um, da -da -da -da. always remember that I 
should be more organized. I really should. There it is. <laughs> I knew I had it here somewhere. You get a little envelope when you make your order. And you get your receipt. And you get pops. Proofs of purchase. And I got two. One for the new collection and one from an order made. <clears throat> so you collect 10 of those or you get a golden one and you get a $5 credit. Hey! Alright. I like to spray these so I think I get the real effect. So let's start off with something light. And this sounds kind of light. It's called Treat Yourself. And I like the name. And it's two people at a bar. And I like, I really like the neon light that the Treat Yourself is on in the back. And it is elderberries, pomegranate, and basil. It's interesting when basil's tossed into scents. Um, cause I like, do you ever use basil in the kitchen? and you chop it up with scissors and it's very aromatic, that scent annoys me so much. Like, I just don't like it. But when it's in a spray and covered by fruity things, I don't mind. Give it a good shake. And I'm gonna spray it this way. And of course it's floating over here. So you can get a sniff too. That's really freaking good. I can really smell the pomegranate, which is my favorite part. So, like, I found out from the Zany Lainey scents that I really do like pomegranate scents. So, kudos. I don't really smell a basil. Like, it could be a back note, but I don't know. Next, I'm going to pick up something. Uh, there's one I want to save for last because it seems a little harsh. <laughs> This one is called The Pit, and it has two characters on it, and they're looking at a playground. Cranberries, lemon, and vanilla. And shaky shaky. Ooh, I like this. This is a little... I think the cranberry is what's... Gives it a little more sophistication, I want to say. But it's not as sophisticated, like, that you don't want to use it in your bathroom. Like, you know, like, I saw it and I was like, oh, it's sophisticated. But then my mind went to, like, oh, this would be good in the bathroom. So, two totally different thoughts and <laughs> shouldn't go like that. But I really like that. <clears throat> Next is called Friends, Waffles, and Work. Waffles, Ozone, and Cedar. Well, cedar, we know is wood. Waffles, we know, are waffles. And ozone, many people don't really understand what that is. It's just pretty much clean air, is what I would say. And... Smells interesting. I'm gonna stand back. I get the waffles a lot. And when you spray it, like I sniffed them by opening the caps before I filmed. And the cedar isn't as, I don't wanna say pungent. Cause that sounds bad, but it's not, it's, it's not as cedary when you spray it as when, opposed to when you sniff it because it smells a lot nicer when you spray it, I think for this one, at least like it's kind of cool. Like, I don't know who I give it to. My mom might like it, but we'll see. Uh, how everything goes like I'm trying to think of like who in my life could use this 
because it's kind of cool. <laughs> and the last one for this collection is called Please and Thank You, Tobacco, Whiskey, and Pine. And there's Nick Offerman, another cool actor, and his boat. <clears throat> tobacco, Whiskey, and Pine. I'm not sure about the tobacco. Whiskey and Pine sounds like it could be banging. Oh, whew. It's good, but very strong. Like, it's punching me in the face. Strong. Whew. Like, definitely, if you have a manly man in your life, to you get your manly man to be manly and say please and thank you. So, definitely... For the man in your life. I would get that for. And. The last. That is all the Parks and Rec scents. And the last one I have right here. Is the one off scent. They will be selling. During the party. It is called Pumpkin King. And the art is really cool. Look at Zero. Is up there. And it's a Nightmare Before Christmas. I don't like the Nightmare Before Christmas. I know. I'm weird unpopular opinion time but I am not opposed to the scent. The scent is dark chocolate, popcorn, and caramel. <sighs> it's heaven. They do chocolate scents so well and, uh, and I feel like I'm gonna sneeze. Earlier tonight we made uh, buffalo chicken half and I had all the peppers and I was sneezing everywhere I'm gonna be sneezing more uh, but this this is really good if you've never had roast chocolate from them that's a lighter version of this this is nice I really like I see when they put pop popcorn and caramel in their scents I would love to smell just popcorn and caramel because that smells so good but chocolate is nice. I do enjoy the chocolate. But I would love to try a popcorn caramel scent. Just that. <laughs> anyway, thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed this sniffy little review thingy we got going on here. I will leave all the zany laney links down below so you can join the group. Um see what episodes are what and just read there will be a lot of info for you thank you so much for watching and i'll see you guys in my next one